I'm Matt Marka. This is Brightline. Let's take us up to Fort Lauderdale. This is Matt's Moments. Come along for the journey. Let's do it. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Brightline. So Brightline is this new train service from the Miami area to all the way up to Orlando now. And I'm gonna take it though, just to Fort Lauderdale. Test out the premium package, what they offer for a lounge, food, drinks, any of that. See how comfortable it is. Hope you join me up to Fort Lauderdale. Let's go get checked in. There's two ways you can book your ticket when you first get in or on the app. Pick your date, pick your class of service and time, put in your information. If you're in premium class, choose your seat. If you're in regular, then I believe it's first come first serve. Once all that's completed, choose your extras, if any, and then pay. And if needed, they have a baggage check-in service too for those big bags. I appreciate all your help, Bob. No, no amazing. problem. You good? Thank you. Rick, tell the boss when you get us today. And that, my friends and family, is how you check in. Those lounge where you have snacks, beer, wine, drinks, anything you name it, as long as you book the premium. To the lounge. Huh? So if you don't book premium, you have a bar you. A la carte. You have this lounge seating right here. Still fairly nice. So I mean there's good options. Brightline does good for all classes of travel. Behind me here is the Brightline Lounge. Use your ticket again. Scan to get in. This lounge was pretty good for a train station. You could watch a game, get some work done, kick your feet up. And if you're hungry, they do have snacks. And most definitely, grab a drink of any kind at this bar. Well, just beer and wine when it comes to alcohol. I kid you not, we practically had the whole place to ourselves. I should have sat in every seat. Let me show you how to get some beer and wine from the drink station. Oops. Just tap on board. Oh, this only? Mm -hmm. Yeah. You do it then? I'm sorry. I'm sorry for this one. Oh, okay. <laughs> you don't need it. Perfect. Apparently you don't need your ticket. And yes, I remember my first time pouring a beer too. If you want wine, they have that too. About 12 minutes prior to departure, they call the premium passengers to go to the train. <laughs> so I'm happy with premium because it seems like the smart travel was smart travel. However, I think it's open seating. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments. Each train car is numbered. Your boarding ticket will say it. I'm in coach one, so Back of the train, let's we'll see how that goes. If you saw my video, link above in Norway, I didn't do so well on a train going backwards. Sorry, it just got dark. Let's get on the train. Hello. The seating is a one two setup with comfy seats, plug ins. Let's have a quick seat tour. The leg room was incredible as you can see. I'm only six foot. Now this little drink table gave me flashbacks of Legionnaire and Frontier Airlines. However, it did have a massive table. And like clockwork, we were off. Right on time for this 30 minute journey to Fort Lauderdale Airport. <laughs> Thank you. Freeze right there. Tell me if you're supposed to use this on your hands and or your face. 
Okay, unpause. Because I do both. <laughs> On a hot day in Miami? It smells good. You are all good. She's all in mind. Thank you. <laughs> so I noticed the frequency of these trains run about every hour from Miami. I'll at the Palm Beach for now with a stop in Fort Lauderdale. That's how you market it. I was very impressed to see a full beverage service on this 30 minute ride. Have you got today? May I offer you a compliment to beverage? Corona? Are you old enough? I hope so. I don't know. <laughs> there you go. Thank you so much. You're very welcome. Enjoy your ride. <laughs> Clearly, I got carded in a way. Are you of age? I love it. I'll take it. So due to recent accidents at the time of filming, Brightling has to stop at uh, street crossings because idiots can't stay behind the arm that goes down. I'd show you a tour of the train, however we ain't got much time, so enjoying the beer, enjoying the premium class. Thank you for choosing Brian Line and have a bright day. What a great pun. As I just saw the airport, I need to give you a quick tour of the bathroom before we arrive. Good job, right line. Excellent bathroom. This is the lower class car. Still nice looking. The conductor actually has to get out of the train. It can come over. Ah, okay. That's why it takes a little bit longer. That's okay. That's good. We like it. Just gotta go and get my bag. <laughs> <laughs> you can just go to uh, baggage. Hello. Okay. I really like this product, and if Amtrak isn't careful enough, I feel like Brightline could move into high density communities and regions and provide a good service. <laughs> Lastly, if you check the bag, look for this guy. And that is the Brightline service. If you enjoyed this video, give me that thumbs up. If you like, even more, share with your friends and family. I'm Matt Marcotte, this is Matt Bombitz. Consider subscribing if you're not already. See you in the next one. So, that black van behind us takes you to the airport. See you in the next one.